The action aid in Andrew's country director, Andrew Mamidu, has now praised President Bolatinibu for his vision of reshaping his cabinet for increased productivity, contrasting with his predecessor, who ignored calls for such changes during his eight-year tenure. The president recognizes that there is need to do more. He recognizes that Nigerians are not satisfied. He recognizes that there's pressure. So in responding to that pressure and for him to deliver better on, the, on his mandate, he needs a stronger, tighter, better team. So that's why um, he is taking that step. If you compare it with the last administration, you will recognize that we ran almost eight years without we just minor changes here and there. But the first year and a few months, this president is already making um, this change. Action Aid Nigeria criticized his cabinet choices, highlighting gaps in gender and youth inclusivity, suggesting that women and youth should have been given more cabinet slots. Among the five that were removed, I know that a young person was among those that was removed, but we didn't see a replacement. Three women were removed and three women were brought in, which is ordinarily a normal pass mark, three for three. But we have not yet, we have not yet uh, achieved the 35 uh, percent gender affirmation that we are looking for. So we thought that this would have been an opportunity for the president to bring in more females since he's reshuffling the cabinet. But we expect that these new ones would uh, would do better than the uh, the ones that have have been removed. And this would also be a momentum to challenge the current administration and uh, the current ministers to say you don't just sit back and just um, think that oh it's normal it's business as usual hello hope you enjoyed the news please do subscribe to our youtube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates